very warm welcome to you on uh, this most pleasantly clear evening. As you can see, we are getting through the uh, pre-match formalities and processes, the uh, players coming onto the field for the usual fanfare and handshakes and so on. Conditions absolutely perfect. Temperatures are kind enough. It is an absolute picture under the floodlights here. One of the, the most recognisable monuments of the English game. It does seem to be a 4-3-3, Jim. Well, one of the attacking advantages in this setup, Peter, is the impact that can be made between fullbacks and the attacking wide players. These combinations, when worked well, can be a real handful for any opposition. And we're likely to witness that again. You often see the wide man drift inside to allow the fullback to make the run out wide, and it can just throw the opposition off kilter. been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much anticipated game the uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic the car parks are full there is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled an atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement and to the english game just joining us, we are. Good challenge, he just stood firm. He spotted the run and played him through. Mohamed Salah! <laughs> Salah plays it in. Stitch defending and the shot, and he's there to make a great save. Pereira puts it to safety. Save. Well, look, believe me when I tell you that goalkeepers work harder than anyone else in training, and that's why to be top class on match day, that was a majestic stop. Lovely feet. Passes into the box. It's a brilliant interception. Gray goes looking. Pereira. Played out to the right. Balls out on the left now. And it's Wijnaldum. Firmino. The shot's on! Oh, the keeper's... oh, smart save. Balls loose. Who's getting there? Madison looks to dink one in. Shakiri. Now it's Roberto Firmino. Sh shoots! There it is! And Liverpool score first! He was urged to shoot, and he duly delivered. Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. So we have our breakthrough. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. Vardy. That always looked inevitable. The defence dealt with that really well. Aimed long and direct. Kasper Schmeichel gets it away. Mane tried to play it through. Ah, it was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. 
at it. They've scored. They have grabbed themselves an equaliser. Well, he was never going to miss from there. So much to aim at. It's rarely a problem when that much time is afforded in the penalty box. Nobody sensed where the danger was lurking, and the finish was made a lot easier. Leicester grab the equaliser, and we're all square. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goal. Mohamed Salah! It's there! That is just remarkable, the amount of bendy got on that. You know, I'm not going to be hard on the goalkeeper because that moved all over the place on its journey. Well, this is what we've been waiting for. Get a throw in. Just brushed off the ball there, and it's Firmino. Good ball. Hits one! Really well taken goal. Well, it certainly livened things up a bit, and that next goal now is absolutely crucial. Ah, oh, the invitation was received with such a clever run, and he had that defence in, in utter confusion. And the first half is done. Liverpool come out of a half that has been quite extraordinary on many counts. High scoring, truly exciting, and neither side able to hold a lead. What a good half. They've gone blow for blow, and it's 2-2. And we are already promptly back on the way. Liverpool playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half, despite this scoreline. Converting chances would make a world of difference for them. Fabinho, now it's Mohamed Salah, Firmino. Oh, good interception. Firmino needed to come up with a better ball. Yeah, the idea was right. The delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. Shoots! I can't speak highly enough of the keeper after that save. Can't stop thinking about it. Morgan. Forward it goes. Madison. Oh, some clever work on the flank. Yeah, they seem to be encouraging both fullbacks to ease inside, so we'll keep an eye on that to see if it if it all works out. Shakiri. And it's Gray. Some good work on the right flank. Now what's next? Some excellent tackling here, and that one a perfect example. That's a throw. Leicester keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. Kasper Schmeichel gets it upfield. Firmino done very well to intervene. Keeper's got good distance on that. And it's Mane. Firmino, two assists to his credit already. Liverpool have it back and they can go again. Defence has got rid of that. Maguire plays it forward. Okazaki. Vardy now on a hat-trick. Pereira spreads it towards the left. 
Gray. Crosses. Can he score? Into Clinton. Now it's Roberto Firmino. Now it's Shakiri. Firmino. He's on his. And the finish! You can get that clear. Keita. And it's Shakiri. Firmino. He's been bundled over. That is a foul. Well, you might think he got off lightly. It is just a verbal warning. And the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to Shakiri! He's produced a beauty. Just a question of hope. And the referee brings it to a close. Liverpool come out on top. Hard fought, impossible to predict. In the end, though, only the result mattered. Thrilling, nail-biting, perhaps frustrating until the very end. But we do have a winner. Well, this looked like it had a, a draw written all over it, Peter, so...